go to and gave you free passage the last time. This time, before I even make it out onto the deck, I need something to be paid to me to even make an appearance here on the deck of Queen Mary 2. So the way we're going to be doing this is we're going to be starting it off by having some of our crew run some competitions, and they're going to be called the starboard side versus the port side. So I want to see how excited we can get everyone here from down the middle to the starboard side. Give you a nice big cheer. Very good. Everyone from the middle to the port side. Give you a nice big cheer. Get your 20% off all the drinks over there. Get yourself a beer in hand. It is nice and warm out here for that event. So what we're going to do to get us started off is we're going to have to have some people organizing this for us, the ones that are going to be keeping track of what's going on. So let's give a nice good round of applause and we welcome out our pirates. Come on, pirates. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, our pirates are on the deck. And they're going to be the ones that are going to need to make sure that everything is done appropriately here on the deck. Because of course, before we even get Queen Neptune out here, we're going to have this competition. So we're going to be starting it off. Ladies and gentlemen, we're going to be introducing you to the crew that will be going through the full works ceremony. And they're going to be going up against each other with starboard side versus the port side. So let's give a big round of applause and welcome to the stage your crew that are going to be getting guns today. Come on down, crew. Where are they? Here they come. Give them a big round of applause. It's the starboard side. Oh, let's see if we can do a little bit better. A big round of applause for the port side. Did you guys get confused on who's on which team? <laughs> it's good to see that the two people from the technical department can't tell the difference between port and starboard. So ladies and gentlemen, we're going to be starting off this very first competition. It is known as the hula hoop game. Starboard side team, as you can see, there should be a hula hoop just by the towels over there. Grab your hula hoop. Port side, grab your hula hoop. This is how it's going to work. It's going to be very, very simple. They're going to be all holding hands. And they're going to be making that hoop go from the top to the bottom, back down to the top, back up to the bottom. I want you to give them a nice big cheer as they do so, because of course the winning team, they just got to have the biggest cheer. Alright, so here they go, they're all lined up, the port side looks like they're ready to go. DJ, are we ready with the music? Yeah? We're ready with the music. Starboard side, are we ready to cheer them on? Port side, are we ready to cheer them on? Alright, well here we go. Remember, it's down. Up, down, up to be the winner. So here we go. In three, two, one, cheer on your team, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you all the way down. Thank you all the way down. We're having a very good one. We're having a very good one. We're having a very good one. We're having a Of course, for us being a maritime nation, 
We have to make sure that our crew, especially our crew, know how to do safety correctly. Don't you agree? <laughs> It is the lovely Claire. Give her a big round of applause. She is not gentle. She is not nice. She will make sure that everybody suffers just a little bit. So here she is, ladies and gentlemen. A big round of applause for your judge as she makes her way down to the stage. Thank you very much, judge, for gracing us with your presence. Is King Neptune around? He's here. Is his CD cord around? They're ready. So, my liege, I'm going to leave this all over to you. So, ladies and gentlemen, enjoy the crossing of the line ceremony. Hear ye, hear ye, hear my call. This court is in session for one and all. The trial of one week we will now repeat. When my lord from the deep will take his seat. Let it be known now, instead of later, that a person who has never crossed the equator is called a polywog of the lowest sort, and must, therefore, be brought to court. But once they've crossed the line, you see, a shellback is what they will be. For here, through all sorts of legal quackery, they are transformed from polywogamy to shell -backery. We may chain them, whip them, shoot them, but first we're gonna prosecute them! So tie each rope and snap each lock and bring the prisoners to the dock. They've been called to answer Superniors to be prosecuted for misdemeanors. The discardiness which is soon to commence will prove with overwhelming evidence they are not just a threat to humans worldwide, they'll take our minds off the buffet inside. <laughs> hear ye, hear ye, my lords, ladies, and gentlemen, pray silence for his royal majesty, the monarch of all the oceans and seas, master of the order of the deep. All hail King Neptune's procession!
My court is aboard from the Monarch of Sea, and I must say, your ship looks fantastic to me. Queen Mary too, so magnificent like you. Captain Andrew Hall, it's nice to see you. <laughs> Thank you, Your Majesty. We are very proud, and we'd like to announce clear and loud. Facelifts make for longer life. By the way, how is your wife? <laughs> Do you compare the ship to me? I need no paint or varnish to see. Ah, oh, bless you! Oh. <laughs> enough, enough, enough of this talk. Get on with it before I walk. Honestly, at home he differs not a fraction. He has much to say, and then no action. <laughs> The guiding star I bestow, an old sea dog, henceforth you go. It will guide you to far distant lands and has been made from recycled cans. <laughs> Thank you, Your Majesty, for this star and for this honour I have travelled far. On behalf of all guests and my crew, to Queen Mary too, I do welcome you. Thank you, Captain. Now call forth the Chief Engineer. Now, Miss Sarah, I know it's thee who gets this ship from A to B. Enough fuel to get there, I hope you've bought. <laughs> For this service you have done, I honour you with a cross. Well won. Thank you, Your Majesty, for this cross. The words just now are at a loss. However, I have just been thinking, when you're done, this pool will be stinking. Thanks. <laughs> Thank you, Chief. <laughs>
brave silence for his majesty. Now lay them on the table, ladies and gentlemen, of Queen Mary II. The fate of these two lies with you. The louder you cheer, the more they get guns. <laughs> Queen Mary II, what do you say? <laughs> Surgeons, I want nothing left. They have been found guilty! <laughs> Royal Entourage. 